Before we go into our final thoughts, I do want to mention this. Uh, starting right now, if you have any prayer requests that you would like for us to remember in prayer, uh, we encourage you to mention those in the chat box here at Pastor's Corner. Uh, those of you that are joining us via YouTube later on, if you want to comment on the video as far as a prayer request, and we'll continue to, to pray with you all about this. Um, but I want to leave you with, with this final, final thought as we're wrapping things up. Something that, that's hitting my, my heart continually. Have you truly found the Lord? Have you truly experienced Emmanuel, God with us? You know, we're living in a time that is unprecedented from any other times. But at the same time, it's not the time that matters. It's the time with Emmanuel himself that matters. This life is but a vapor and it will be gone very fast. But it's the time that we spend with him now that helps us to be ready for spending eternity with him. Whether this, this wait is another five years, 10 years, 100, 200, however many years, we need to live ready now so that we're able to be with him forever in eternity. Please know that as I'm saying this, I'm not just speaking to those of you that are here right now with us and those of you that are watching later, I'm speaking to myself as well. But let's, let's spend a few moments together in prayer and then I have a final thing as we're wrapping up. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for that reminder the fact of Emmanuel continually meaning God with us. By the name, by the action, by the lifestyle, may that name continue to change us into your likeness. Father, we don't want to be in and of ourselves and about ourselves anymore. We want to be about you. We want to be about your business. Show us what you would have us to do. Show us the way forward. Show us how you want us to live. And not just that, how you call us to only believe. Guide us in your word. Guide us in your likeness. Show us your face. Help us to be more and more like Jesus, we pray. In the name of Jesus, amen. You know, next week, We'll be starting a brand new series taking a look at John chapter 9, entitled Only Believe. Also starting next week, I will start reminding you at the very beginning of our study time, if you have prayer requests, please drop them off in the chat box so that we here at Pastor's Corner can be praying for those, not just through the program, but we can also pray with them, uh, pray about them together with you at the end of the program as well. You know, here, here at Pastor's Corner, here at Safe Haven Student Outreach Center, God has blessed us so tremendously. But at the same time, we look to all of you for help as well. Whether that is monetary, helping with financial obligations that we have here at the center or uh, here at Pastor's Corner with the different things and the pastoral support that we have to take care of, or the different ministries that Safe Haven Ministries does as well. If you would like to help us with finances or even help us with time or help us with some other things, I encourage you to give us a call. Drop something off in, in the chat box or send us an email. Uh, at the end of the program, we'll be putting our information up once again to where you can have our contact information. But we would love for you to come and partner with us on this journey that God has called us to. We believe that the more of us that are able to partner on this journey, the stronger we'll be, not just in the ministries, but helping these kids to have a better college experience and showing them Jesus by how we live our lives. And isn't that what life is about? Is about showing them Jesus, showing them Emmanuel, that God is still with us, and he works through us 
works in us as we continue to journey together with him. Speaking of journeys, I invite you to join me on my blog, districtdevotional.blogspot.com. Tuesdays for the written, Thursdays for the video. Uh, as of the beginning of the year, we will be changing the name from District Devotional to Pastor's Corner Devotional, and I'll be putting a new video onto the site talking about that uh, within the next couple of days as far as the reason for that transition. But I invite you to come out, join us for that. Join us every Sabbath afternoon for this time of study, for this time of learning. If you know someone that would be blessed by this, please give them the information so that they can be blessed. If they're not able to join at this time, I encourage you to pass on the YouTube link for Pastor's Corner to say, hey, here's something I've been encouraged with, and I want to encourage you as well. I hope and pray that you have an amazing rest of your Sabbath. And as we continue through the last few days of this year, may we continue to remember the name Emmanuel, God with us, and he's never going to leave us. Until next time, I look forward to seeing you next Sabbath as we continue to study God's word together. God bless.